One of the most important skills you're going to need for university assignments is how to reference your work correctly. References tell your reader where to find the sources you based your work on and also gives credit for the work that other people have done. If you don't reference properly then you might lose marks on the assignment and you might also be accused of academic misconduct as without a reference you're effectively saying that the material is your own when it's actually someone else's so it's really important to get this right. You must include a reference for every source that you use in your assignment. That includes figures, tables, graphs as well as text as they all need referencing. All references require the following. You need an inline citation in the main body of your text where you're discussing the source and an entry in a reference list at the end of the document that gives full details of where to find that source. There are many different referencing styles around. The main systems are Harvard and APA which have name date style inline citations and present the reference list in alphabetical order of surname. There are also numerical systems such as Vancouver which use a number for the inline citation and then the reference list is in numerical order. You must use the referencing style required by your subject. Check with a module leader if you're not sure which one that is. And you must use that style consistently throughout your assignment. In either system, the inline citation should be placed in a grammatically sensible place within your text. That's usually before the full stop at the end of the sentence because it's an important part of that sentence, but you don't want it to disrupt the flow, so you don't want it in the middle of the sentence to make it awkward to read. Formatting references manually can be a real pain, so to avoid doing that manually, we'd recommend using a reference manager. There's many different reference manager software systems available, and many of them are free to use. Maybe talk to your academic support tutor about which the best one to use might be. So here are some rules for referencing to remember. All external pieces of information should be referenced. All references should be in the same style and the correct style for your subject. All references need an inline citation in the text and an entry in the reference list. Inline citations should be in a grammatically sensible place within your sentence. If you follow these rules, then you should be able to format your work correctly. It might take a little bit of practice to getting used to, but you'll soon get the hang of it. If you're unsure what to do, the university library pages have some really good advice, or you can ask your academic support tutor for help.